Hi everybody, it's Vicky. I hope you're all doing well. Craig informed me yesterday that yesterday was day 30 of the lockdown, so that makes today day 31. I've no idea what day it actually is. I think it's Thursday, but who knows? What is time? As I keep saying, what is time? So for today's little exercise thing, you, I've got you at a funny angle today because you're gonna need a wall and this is the best wall I've got. So there you go. Uh, now, lots of the stuff I've shown you has been sort of around the shoulders and into the neck and stuff like that and concentrating very much on the muscles at the back of the body. But if you know anything about muscles, hello, whoever just came on, you'll know that muscles work in pairs. So there's the muscles at the back of the body and the muscles here at the front of the body in your chest. And if you are spending a lot of time, so I spent the last couple of days at my desk at the sewing machine, kind of like this, and if you do spend a lot of time like that, what you'll find is, yes, you get stiffness and tightness in the back, in the shoulders and the neck and stuff, but you'll also get tightness in the big pectoral muscles here, because the, the action they do in the body is they bring your arms in like this. So if you're constantly like this with your shoulders rolled in or whatever, these muscles are working all the time and they can be feeling really tight. So for today's little exercise, all I'm gonna do, hi Debbie. So I'm stood at such a distance, I can't actually see the comments unless I bend down. <laughs> so for today's exercise, I'm gonna talk you through it first, simply because when I actually do it, I'm gonna be facing the wall and you won't be able to hear me very well. So what you need is you need a wall where ideally you can put your arms out in a T like this. Now, because I've got very long arms, uh, I struggle in our house because most of the big walls have got radiators next to them, so I'm sort of leaning like this, which is not what we want. So I'm doing it on this little wall here, and I'll do it in the middle. So you're going to stand facing the wall with your arms out in a little T like this. And then all you're going to do is you're going to very slowly turn to one side like this, very slowly. Shoulders and back against the wall, and you'll feel the stretch going into your pectoralis muscle here. Now, as ever, with any of these things, if you've got any existing medical condition stuff like that, just take it easy or do get checked out first. And any injuries as well, do get checked out by a medical professional first. But yeah, so today we're working on stretching the pectoralis out. So here we go. Facing the wall. I've got my hands against the wall and I'm going to turn this way first. So all I'm doing is I'm just taking very small steps round to the side. I'm keeping my side pressed against the wall here and I'm really feeling the stretch into the front and into the front of my armpit here. And I'm just going to hold this for sort of eight to ten seconds or so like this. Oh I'm going to try not to cry and then I'm going to very slowly come back to my starting position. Now make sure when you are moving around you do take it slow. Please don't go whizzing around because I can assure you from videos on YouTube a torn practoralis is not fun. Okay so to do the other side which is going to be this side here Again, facing the wall, and I'm very slowly and steadily going to turn until I just feel a stretch into the front of my arm there. And I can really feel it on this side, but I'm keeping my body in contact with the wall, my hand in contact with the wall and my arm. Now, you might find that one side you can turn more than the other. That's totally fine. That's totally normal. Please just take it to where you feel a gentle stretch. Hold for eight to ten seconds, slowly back to the middle and slowly to the other side. Uh, good to do on your lunch break or when you finish for the day, just to get everything opened out a bit in the chest here. And um, yeah, that's everything with that one. So hopefully that will have made sense. Hopefully you'll be able to actually hear my voice when I'm facing the wall. And yeah, I'll see you all very, very soon. Okay.